give it up, Daniel. This time you are going down. Combo! Supreme humiliation! No! This controller's broken! Give me yours! I'm off, sweetheart. Have a good day with your best friend. <laughs> what do you mean, Mom? It's just me. Oh, Daniel, how could you forget Mr. Tickles? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Mr. Tickles sure is my best friend in the world. Be good, you two. And not too much TV, okay? Maybe you want a little space just for you and your best friend. Come on, Erico. Mr. Tickles is just my cuddly toy. Didn't you ever have one? My cuddly toy? I had completely forgotten. Such a nice smell. Like vanilla and warm bread. Had a little mustache. And actively took part in several revolutions. Huh? Abuelita, my old nanny. She's the one who looked after me when I was little. Ah. Anyway, that's all in the past. Who knows where she is today? Hmm. I hate surprises. Ta-da! Abuelita! Kill me, Fabas Titi. Abuelita! I can't believe it! I've missed you so much! Meet you, Mavistran, Jan. So I'm going to teach you three moussas. She says that I'm too skinny and that we'll need to fat me up. Are you sure she can see well? Oh, Pichu Pluma del Caboso, Chopolo Bamba Marcia Baila. There's so much to tell you. So many victories, zero defeats, some doubts. <laughs> some doubts. Ah, uh, Daniel, this is kind of personal. Could you give us a little space, please? Back up. More? The door. Can I come back now? No! How about now? No! How? No! Uh, there we go. Unchanged over the centuries, fly fishing is more than just a sport. For some fly fishermen, it's Can we switch art. to cartoons instead? <laughs> Abuelita loves documentaries. The laws are often made by the fly fishermen themselves, mm. taking long hours of meticulous preparation. Shh. That's the end of our program. And now, a look at the reproductive cycle uh. of jellyfish. Contrary to popular belief, jellyfish do... <gasps> what? Already? We've got to take Abuelita back to her retirement home. Shh. Look. She's sleeping. We don't want to disturb her. Mm. Hey, where am I gonna sleep? Shh! Old people's sleep is sacred. She's so adorable when she sleeps. There we go. I've got tickets for mini motorcycling. Awesome! Oops, but I only have two. Looks like Abuelita will have to go back to the retirement home. Hmm? But it's too rough for someone her age. You kidding? She survived several wars. What's a mini bike track to her? Hey, Daniel, do you like donuts? <laughs> What's that? Practice! She played for the national team. Still in good shape, huh? Kion me faras chichi. Tomorrow we can squeeze in canoeing just after laser tag if we don't spend too long bowling. What? 
But we were supposed to go to the game together tomorrow. I even got us matching ball caps. You want us to just leave, Abuelita? Have you no heart? That does it! Ever since Abuelita got here, you've spent all your time with her! Come on, why so jealous, Daniel? You haven't seen Daniel, have you? Please disappoint me. Don't tell me he's still sulking. <laughs> ah! Daniel? What are you doing? Since you like Abuelita better, I decided to become an old lady, too. Take that wig off! You look ridiculous, Daniel. Hmm? Abuelita, I hope you and Erico are happy! Still no news of Mrs. Sylvia Martinez, who has disappeared from her retirement home. Mom has never done this before. The kids are absolutely devastated. Sylvia, that's me, Avilino. Erico, are you really, really sure that this is Abuelita? Now that you mention it, her eyes were green, and she had a wooden leg. What? Hey, you're the one who told me it was her. I wasn't sure, but you seemed so happy. That means... We've kidnapped an old lady! Okay, we need to take her back, right now! But everybody's looking for her, Erico! If somebody recognizes her outside, we're gonna go to prison! To prison! If you have any information regarding the disappearance of Mrs. Martinez, please contact the police immediately. No! Okay, stop, stop. We're gonna find a solution, Daniel. Orange doesn't suit me at all. Ugh, and close that window! Abuelita's gonna catch a cold. Old people's health is sacred, Daniel. Oh no, my hat! My scarf as well! And my funny glasses! Hmm. Coast is clear, Erico. It's you! I know you. I saw you on TV. The dress of my dreams! <sighs> there you are! I knew I'd find you! My self-esteem. Wait, 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 wait! Forgetting your bus ticket? <sighs> wait, 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 wait! You think I don't see what's going on with your old mustachioed friend? He gets a senior citizen discount! <sighs> wait, 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 wait! Have a splendid day! That one! Yeah, a little too festive, right? <laughs> ah, there you go! That one's scary! Phew. We drop her here, ring the bell, and run for it. Ready, Daniel? <laughs> what are you waiting for? I can't do this. I just can't leave Abuelita like this. But she's not Abuelita! 
How would you know? You said she had a wooden leg! Well, lizard's tails grow back! Abuelita, you want to go? Female truffles means tulta bando. Mrs. Martinez, we were so worried about you. That's it. She's gone now. So what did she say when she was hugging us? She said that as we go forward in life, leaving memories behind, we should keep them in our hearts and learn to cherish them. Aww. It was either that or let me go inside. It's freezing out here. <laughs> I'm not sure. <laughs> Daniel, I'm counting on you to get my body back. Right, Eriko! So you get back out there and you show them what you're made of! You got it, Eriko! Go get him, champ! Yeah! Eriko, my laces are undyed. Yo! Penalty! Daniel, you're shot! <laughs> Come on, you can do it. Shoot! Miss the ball. So I know you're terrifying, unstable, pig headed. Mm hmm. But I give up. Daniel is uncoachable. Go ahead, ask me anything else. Establish world peace. Take up tennis. Come on, can't you just give me my body back? No one has to know. Next. So, about my dog allergy, I'm not sure your solution was a real game changer. Um. Huh? A game changer? Hmm. If I can't make Daniel a good fit for football, maybe I can make football a better fit for Daniel. Football Association, how may I help you? Um, uh, hello. This is uh, uh, Bobby Football speaking. <laughs> Robert Football? <laughs> the Robert Football? Are you kidding me? The inventor of football! Christine, guess who's on the line? Come on, say a name! Say a name! Guess! <sighs> Robert Football? Yes! The Robert Football! <laughs> <clears throat> Robert Football? Yeah. Yes? It's an honor, Mr. Football. Can I call you Bob? Yeah, no. Get a pen, son. I'd like to change the rules of football. Oh? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the Federation called, kids. There's been a few rule changes. Yes! Come on, you can't miss this one! Kick it! Oh, is this the Federation? Yes, it's rubber football again. Here we go. Our goals now adhere to the new Federation standards. <laughs> Come on. There's no way you can miss this one. Mr. Football? No! You never bother me! New rule. There's no more need for a goalkeeper. <laughs> Stitch! Mr. Football? New rule.
stop observing that these new rules favor Daniel. You think? <laughs> nah, never mind. <laughs> today was great! The rules are a bit weird. But still, today was great! Hmm? What are you doing? It's a game I made up. You can't let the ball drop. I call it stay. I'm good, right? Yeah. Shame it's not a real sport. <gasps> hey. Mr. Football? Are you really sure, Mr. Football? The consequences could be dire. Very well. When it comes to football, you're the boss. Hey, kids! Wait up! The Federation's changed its rules again. Aww. So, no more little carp. Huh? No more giant ball. Huh? No more big cages. Huh? And all the billboards with Daniel's face have been removed. Yay! Now there's just one rule. Uh -huh. You have to balance the ball on your nose and keep it from falling. What? Oh, it's just like the game I made up. It's just like the game I made up. Just like the game I made up! Hmm. <gasps> <laughs> 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 oh, wow! Look at that! Got a genius over here. His body is one with a ball! It's as if his head was specially designed for this. I am done with football. Whoa. <laughs> yes. Aw, <laughs> you guys, come on, stop. I'm not that good. <sighs> Welcome back to our live coverage of the World Cup Final. The last spectators are leaving and the sponsors are having their billboards removed as the final game drags on and on. Who will be the first to crack? The German forward, Greta Moll, or... Oh, 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 I'm starting to have cramps! Or Daniel Sisu of the Hazelnuts. Come on, Daniel! Destroy her! Achtung, I cannot talk! <laughs> this is too hard! Too hard! My willpower is fading! <laughs> and it's over! Victory goes to the unstoppable Daniel Sisu! People are already calling him the Platana of new football. Wait, what? I'm the world champion! Look, Erico, now I've won the Champions Cup, the Golden Football, the Crystal Cleat, the Silver Shin Pet, and the World Cup! Uh... Now I'm as good as you are. We're equals. Trophy Brothers! We're not equals! My trophies are actually real. But mine are real too. Yeah, yeah, true. Okay, then uh, get your trophies and let's go get my body back. Hmm. The diamond goal and the World Cup. That's enough to confirm he's a champion, right? I really have become a champion, Mr. Sorcerer. I'm as good as Erico now. Even better, some people say. What? I mean, yes, yes, uh, of course. I've heard a few people say that once or twice. Everyone says so. They're even going to rename the Platana Stadium to be the Daniel Sisu Stadium. You're not better than me! You didn't play football! You just bounced a ball in your nose! I changed the rules so that you'd win! Does that mean... you didn't think I could do it? Wait, but it was to help you. 
Don't take it the wrong way! Daniel! Daniel! So, do I give your body back? Do I not give your body back? <sighs> it's up to you. Get back up and kick with the inside of your foot so you can control it better. Have you come back here to make fun of me? <gasps> Erico! Didn't you get your body back? Ah, uh, no. No, the sorcerer didn't want to. So you didn't change your mind to come back and train me? Because you believe in me? What? <laughs> no! Okay, let's get back to practice. You got it, Erico! Mm -hmm. Mr. Football? Really? Everything's going back to how it was? Whoa! Thank you, Mr. Football! Yes! Bills. Bills. Junk mail. Bills. Holy guacamole! Everything okay, Maple? Someone sent us a check, kids. One of you must have caught the eye of an anonymous talent scout. Wow. Wow. Wow! Who's that really big check for, Maple? It's for... It's for... It's for you, Daniel! Huh? I never noticed Daniel was that good. If he's worth that much money, he must be really amazing! <laughs> Did you hear, Erico? Who would want to invest that much in me? I don't know, Daniel. Probably someone rich and powerful. Mom? No, Daniel, it's me. You? So you do believe in me? Of course not. It's all part of my plan. If I bet big on you, you'll get all the major club's attention, your career will take off, and I will get my body back. You think so? Of course! How do you think I got my big break? My first few checks arrived, and boom! Three weeks later, I was a star. I don't know, Erico. Nobody knows who I am. Just you wait, Daniel. Just you wait. <laughs> Go. I'm on TV, this magazine, even that cereal box. Told ya, your popularity rating's gone up three points as I made my coffee. Check it. Do you think I've got what it takes? Of course. Relax. Just do everything you normally do. But do not go anywhere near the ball. Huh? Everyone thinks you're a star. If they see you play, your popularity will tank. Really? But I've gotten so much better lately. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> Wait, you were serious? <sighs> You're no good at football, Daniel. You were no good yesterday. You're no good today. And for tomorrow, we've got our work cut out for us. But how am I gonna get good if I can't practice anymore? Believe me, you don't have to be good to be a star. You just need everyone to believe you're one. Hey, Maya. Hey, Maya. Hey there, Daniel. Nice haircut. Uh, thanks. My mom cuts it for me. Mom cuts it. Danny and I, we're like brothers. I taught him everything he knows. Hey, Larry. Danny! What's up, bro? You up for a few practice kicks after practice as per usual? Uh, sure, Larry. I'd love to. Love to. What are we supposed to do with 5,000 botched jerseys? Make Daniel get a nose job? Erico, everyone's acting kind of weird today. T 
talking to his ball? <laughs> now that you're popular, you're their hero, their icon. You've got the star glow. The star glow? The star glow. Oh, oh no! Oops! Sorry, Steven. Sorry, Daniel. Sorry! It's okay, Steven. <laughs> it wasn't your fault. Thank you, Daniel. Thank you. The star glow, Daniel. The star glow. The star glow. The star glow. Talking to his hand. Ah, Daniel, just in time. I organized a big interview for you on TV. Should I wear the off-white or the light gray suit? Neither. I canceled. Told them you had more important things to do. Nice one. Trust me, Daniel. In a week's time, you'll have all the major clubs at your feet. Like when you started out. Oh, yeah. You weren't any good, but people bet big on you. Oh, yeah. Wait, 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 what? Yeah, you weren't a star either, but as soon as people believed in you, boom! Straight to the top. Are you kidding? I've always been super talented. People called me the little miracle. Yeah, yeah, I get it, Erico. What's important is that everyone thinks so. No! I was a prodigy! Football's in my blood! I had my own line of watches when I was eight! <laughs> it was different from me, okay? Daniel, better than me? Puh, no way. Is he? No. Is he? No. Hazelnuts, we're rich. <gasps> Daniel! 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 Platana Top 10 Best Goals. There. Aha! Wait, what? Platana Top 10 Bloopers? Platana Top 20 Blown Goals? Platana Top 50 Embarrassing Moments? was right. My whole career's a, a joke. I'm a fraud. Erico, I've got big news. Look, three minutes of play. And I still haven't scored a goal. It's true that I probably would have scored by now. And how come you never told me I have such a big chin? I'm an imposter, Daniel. An imposter with a huge chin. So, uh, what's your big news? I've been bought by a major club. We're going into the Pro League. We did it! Great. But it's just what you wanted. I become a champ and you get your body back. Uh, a useless body for a useless life. It's time we went our separate ways, Daniel. All I've ever done is hold you back. That's not true, Erico. I could never have made it without you. I don't need your pity, Daniel. Maple's waiting for me on the field with the team scout. Will you at least come with me? Mm -hmm. <sighs> We're going to miss our little star. You got yourselves a good deal. <laughs> ah! Here's our little prodigy. Sorry, I was just finishing packing. Don't worry, son. From now on, you'll have everything you need. Ready to take the plunge? Fly away, baby bird. Mm hmm Ah, uh, it's never easy when they leave the nest. <laughs> Can I get a shot of you scoring? Yes, of course. Let 
me try that again. <laughs> what a joker! <laughs> Come on, Daniel! These nice people don't have all day! <laughs> Ah, <laughs> oh, that was so close. <laughs> Sorry. One more try. For crying out loud, Daniel, kick the damn ball. <laughs> Our lawyers will be in touch. No, wait. I have other players. Come back. Oh, Daniel. You flew too close to the sun. You forgot how bad we are. What'd you expect? <laughs> you could just shoot and... Huh? Speed. Power. Precision. I scored, and I don't even have any legs! I'm a star! I knew it! I'm a real star! <laughs> and my chin is perfect. I stink, Erico. I Stink! Ah, oh, you don't stink. You've just got room for improvement. And that's a good thing. Otherwise, what would I do, right? But, I won't lie, your popularity's tanked a little. Hey, there's something that's been bothering me. You didn't blow that shot on purpose, did you? Just so we could stay together? Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't, Erico. Nah, you really blew it. Yep. Daniel, Daniel, Daniel. How did you manage to lose only one shin guard? Oh, I don't know, Erico. <sighs> well, let's take a look through my old things and see what we can find. Oh. <laughs> You're too young for this. Uh, this is not mine. Oh, <laughs> I was sure I threw that away. Aww. Are these drawings from when you were a kid? No, that's from a couple years ago. Sketches from my graphic novel. You used to draw comics, Erico? Uh-uh-uh. Graphic novels, Daniel. I've always made time to explore my many talents. Erica Platana is a complete artiste. Joel, the cheeky squirrel. Oh, the adventures we had together. His best friend is a talking tire? You bet. This project was pure genius from start to finish. But anyway, that's all in the past now. Why'd you give it up? No time, Daniel. What with games, interviews, selfies. When you're a superstar, there's no time for hobbies. Too bad you stopped. You sure don't have those problems anymore. Maybe not now, but I intend on getting my body back soon, so get your butt in gear, Daniel! Even better than the real thing. Erico, look! I made myself a new shin guard. Are you coming? We're gonna be late for practice. Wow! Just in time. I need a fresh pair of eyes. You're back to the drawing board? I couldn't resist the call of Joel. I've drawn pages and pages since yesterday. It's like it was always in me. What do you think? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Well, it rocks, right? I've already called ten different publishers. Uh, um, the drawing of the clouds is funny. The fight scene? You're holding it upside down. <laughs> You know what, Erico? Comics are nice, but you already know where your true talents lie. Of course. How could I forget? Now I remember the scent of leather, the squeak of souls. That was my real passion, Daniel. Shoe making! 
What? Ha! <laughs> Graphic Illustrator, what was I thinking? Being a shoemaker is my true calling. But what about practice? Not now, Daniel. I have to strike the leather while it's hot. But you'll come to see me play, right? Yeah, yeah, go ahead. I'll be there later. Okay, Eriko. You're yeah. making your dad That's proud, my son. baby girl. Daniel? Ah, just in time. The Welton gave me a stitch, but I got the upper hand at last. You made me shoes? Not just any shoes. Platanas. The shoe I've always dreamed of making. Stylish, comfortable, and high performance. I know. Breathtaking. Go on. Try them on. Uh, I don't know, Erico. Go on. Tell me what you think. It's just a couple hours work, you know? <laughs> and a lifelong dream. <laughs> well, am I a genius or what? There, uh... I've never had shoes like these before. <laughs> you better believe it. Good, I'll call the factory. Feet all around the world are gonna be singing my name. I mean, uh, shoemaking is great, and you've uh, got a... Oh, got a gift. But maybe you should put that aside for the moment, you know? Uh, so you can concentrate on your real talent. Holy cow, Daniel. Of course. Now I remember. The applause, the glitz, the glamour, the beating of Dove's wings. Magic! How could I have been so blind? That's my true calling. No, Erico, it's foot... Abracadabra! <laughs> okay, I might be a little rusty. Can you at least come see the match this afternoon? Yeah, yeah, don't worry. You promise? Yeah, 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 I promise. Is it this one? No. Okay, then. Is it this one? No. Oh, I must have dropped it. Oh, of course! My nail arts kit! Huh. My makeup set! My hairdressing equipment! My old paintball gear! My DJ turntable! My ventriloquist puppet! What's up, Daniel? My propane barbecue! Oh, don't worry, I've got my volunteer fireman helmet in here somewhere! Hey, what's this? <laughs> Rough around the edges, but inspiration takes time, Daniel. Sorry, Mr. Box, but you need to go away. It's better for everybody. Don't do it, Daniel! You can't throw me away like that without talking to Erico first! But he won't listen to me. You know how he gets when he's fixated on something. I agree. It's the only way. But if you do that, you'll regret it for the rest of your life! Don't pay attention to him, Daniel. You can never trust a puppet. But you're a puppet, too! <laughs> Daniel? Do you come to do some fly fishing, too? Hey! That's my stuff. You've got to stop this, Erico. Every 20 minutes, you switch obsessions. You'll never get your body back if you stop training me. I can't help it if I'm good at everything. Like I said, I'm a 
complete artiste! But you're not a complete artiste! You're not good, Erico! I hate Joel the Squirrel! <gasps> your shoes gave me blisters! <gasps> and your ice sculptures are pretty average. <gasps> but at football, you're a genius. That's more than enough. <laughs> Gee, thanks, Daniel. I thought we were friends. I'll see you later, Dream Crusher. Hmm. Fine, Joel, you win. Erica will never play football again. Hmm? Can I help you? Or have you just come to shatter my dreams again? No, I've come to save them. Do you know what's in every frame of your comic? A gripping narrative and hysterical jokes? No. A uh, football. And do you know what's all over your shoes? Quality and a painstaking attention to detail. Plates! Your nail art? Football! Your hairdressing? Football! 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 I don't see what that proves. It's just a coincidence. It proves that football has always been your true passion. You put it in everything you do. Oh, come on. What about my ice sculpture, then? Wow. You're right, Daniel. No matter what I do, football always runs through my veins. But that's a good thing, Erico. It means that you're really into your passion. And on top of that, you're a superstar! Oh, yeah? And if I never get my body back, what happens to the superstar then? If I really can't be the best player in the world anymore, what will become of me? The best coach in the world. And anyway, you'll always be a superstar to me. Oh, Daniel. My saxophone? Ditch it. My hand-painted plates? Ditch them. There's just one thing left. Ah! <gasps> Shin guards! Ah! I knew I put them somewhere. <laughs> What's with all the huffing and puffing? Maple's got some big news. Okay, hazelnuts. There's gonna be some changes around here. Starting today, it's practice, practice, practice! <laughs> Daniel, am I dreaming? Or are you finally going to play football? We're gonna start with 10 laps of the field, then push-ups, pull-ups, sit-ups, dribbles, passes, penalty shootouts! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Happy birthday, Steven! <laughs> you got me. You really got me. Oh, deep down, I knew it wasn't true. 52 years old? No, oh, that's a cause for celebration. This team is killing me. Football isn't a joke. There's no game without... Pain. Exactly. Wait, what? Pain. Pain. I don't know, Erico. I don't see anything unusual. Your friend's got a problem, Daniel. Look at her! Pain! But Tame is always like that. That's her thing. Dark and brooding. Football's a team sport. If one player's got a problem, the whole team's got a problem. Especially if it's the only good player. But... The only good one! So be a proper team captain and go talk to her. Hey, Tamea, Can I sit here? Sure. What's up these days? You good? Yeah. You want some cake? Thanks. Well, nice talking to you. Later. Everything's fine, Erico. Tamei is the same as always. Are you kidding? She barely said two words. Yeah, but that's how she is. 
quiet and mysterious. So it's worse than I thought. There's nothing to worry about, Eriko. I'll prove to you that Timaeus fine. I'll go and make her laugh. <laughs> I'd pay good money to see that. Oh no, please don't tell me you're doing the clown. Yep, you're doing the clown. Right, Eriko. Tamea's not okay. She didn't laugh at a single one of my gags. Not even the surprise tickle attack. Pain! Pain! Maybe we need more clowns. No, Daniel. No more clowns. But, Eriko... No! More clowns! You know what makes people happy? Money. When I feel down, I just buy myself something nice and... ka I feel much better. But what would make Tamea happy? I'm telling you, money buys happiness. Just buy her something. And that works? If it doesn't work, just buy something more oh. expensive. Hmm. Tamea Morganson? Yeah. I've got a solid gold watch for you with a diamond bezel and a calfskin bracelet. Will you please sign for it? Nah. What about for the jet ski? Turbo engines and a leopard print paint job with calfskin upholstery. Nah. What about these bags of money? Start her up, Louie. We're sending it all back. My name is Sylvia, but whatever. I don't think she liked our presents, Erico. I told you to get two jet skis. Only cheapskates give one jet ski. I'll call the dealer. No, Erico. We need help. It's time to ask a responsible adult. You did the right thing coming to see me, Daniel. You see, adolescence is like a tightrope strung between you and others. It's not easy to find your balance. Everyone is finding themselves at that age. Even I went through my rocker phase. Believe me, Daniel. The best way to reach Tamea's heart is through her ears. That music is diabolical! Diabolical! Well, I guess we'll have to save Tamea by ourselves. No, Eriko. It's not just us. Pain. Well... Tamea needs us, Hazelnut. We have to cheer her up. Mm -hmm. If we want to open up a positive, honest conversation, we could just encourage her to talk about her feelings. Or we could just show her cute cat pictures. Mm -hmm. We've got to encourage her. Nothing beats a good compliment or two. Right, Junior? Right? Right? Yeah, or we could just give her some space. What about flowers? Everyone loves flowers. Do something nice for her! Chocolates! Call a hypnotist! Wowee! They've got so many ideas! Which one do we choose? We choose all of them. All of them? All of them! All of them? That's crazy! That would be... A, a perfect, perfect day! day. Target is getting close. Everything ready, Daniel? Daniel! You need to say over. Otherwise, I don't know if it's my turn to talk. Over. Duh. Is everything ready, Daniel? Over! Affirmative, Eriko. The trajectory is locked. I've got Agents Tiger Lily, Big Daddy, Blondie, and Skinny Steve all in position. Over. <sighs> all right. She just passed the door. Good luck, everyone. Over. Roger. Okay, Tiger Lily. Compliment in. Three, two, one. Hi, Tamea. You look really good today. Thanks. You're up, Blondie. Here, Tamea, I picked you some fresh flowers. Mostly dark roses and black orchids. No, thanks. Chocolates? Not now, Big Daddy. Not now. Not now. 
Quick, we need to move on. Music, Skinny Steve. <laughs> We've lost her. Tiger Lily, send in the cats. The cats! Pain. It's not working. Code red. I repeat, code red. It's all or nothing now. <laughs> Surprise! We've given your locker a makeover. We've changed your old paint for a tasty new varnish, raspberry colored. And since you like stickers, we've covered your locker with funny, cute ones. Okay, that's it. I'm off the team. What? But wait, we haven't done the dance routine or brought out the cookies yet. Uh, I mean, <laughs> There may be other surprises in store. I'll come back tomorrow to pick up my things. Chocolates! It'll never be the same again without Demea. Might as well stop playing football right now. Chocolates. Eriko, I think we got it wrong. You bet we got it wrong! Cross-eyed cats? Seriously, what was that? Skateboarding cats. Now that's what I'm talking about. Maple was right all along. If we want to reach Tamea's heart, going through her ears is the only way. I know how to get Tamea to come back. Rock and roll. begging you. Anything but that. Huh? Okay. We just wanted to cheer you up so you wouldn't be sad anymore. I'm not sad. Why does everyone think I'm sad? We heard you shouting pain by the trash cans, under the bleachers, in the bushes. Pain is the name of my cat. He ran away. But he came back. Didn't you, Pain? <laughs> oh! Is he a Siamese? No, he's a short-haired Tonkinese. He's adorable! Uh, can you please get changed now? You're making me really uncomfortable. Has the concert been canceled? Oh, wow! Tell me about that one! Again? You know that story by heart. Oh, come on, please! Oh, fine, okay. <clears throat> In 2011, Platana's hairstyle not only shocked millions of spectators, it also completely reinvented Mohawk Sideburns. Mohawk Sideburns? Hmm. You know, speaking of hairstyles, Daniel, it's about time we take care of yours. Really? But, uh, Mom is the one who cuts my hair. Oh, Daniel, Daniel. Don't you think the greatest football player on the planet would also be the greatest hairstylist on the planet? Hmm? Uh, okay. Oh, I knew you'd come to your senses. So, given the shape of your head, we're gonna have to be a little creative. Hmm. Good morning, world. Good morning, my little kettle. Good morning, my little squashes. Good morning, my lower back. Good morning, my little cup. Oh, 
3 p.m. already? Time to get ready for practice. Good afternoon, my little hazelnuts. Say, where's Daniel? Sisu, you look like a kneecap that tried to grow a beard. <laughs> <laughs> you look like an old fogey trying to look younger. <laughs> you know who you look like? You look exactly like... Oh. <laughs> today's, today's practice is canceled. I'm just not feeling up to it. <laughs> Maple, I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to make fun of you. <laughs> oh. Nice work, <laughs> Sisu. Now Maple will never want to coach us again. He always tied my laces for me. <laughs> he always made the coolest cupcakes. <laughs> Where are we gonna get a new coach now? <laughs> when they assigned this team to me, everyone said it was a lost cause. Who are you? Boy, were they ever wrong. You guys stink, but that's about to change. I'm gonna turn you into champions. <laughs> Any questions? Uh... You're off the team! Everyone else, ten laps! Ah, <laughs> uh, are you sure you know what you're doing, Eriko? Uh, you've never coached a team before. Daniel, shh, Daniel. Has it ever occurred to you that the greatest football player and hairstylist on the planet would also be a champion coach? Uh, is champion coach a thing? Hey! Don't think I can't see you dragging your feet! I'm gonna sculpt your pudgy little bodies into winning machines! Thirsty? A real champion licks the dew off the field! You're off the team! <sighs> hey, what's this? You're off the team! Maya, what do you think of the new coach? She's an insecure tyrant who will drive us into utter chaos and disaster. Maya, is that Velcro laces I see on your shoes? You're off the team! Have fun without me! That's enough! Eriko, we need to talk. You're off the team! Oh, it's you. Sorry, Daniel. Uh, so, what's up? You can't just get rid of everyone. I'm the only one left! Yeah. Uh... No. There's still, um, uh, Steven? <laughs> You're off the team! Oh, well, uh, if they don't have what it takes, we'll just buy better players. Is that it? I told you we had no money. No one is that broke. Maple must have stashed some cash somewhere. So what do we have here? Nothing. 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 Oh, there has to be something. How can somebody be this broke? Seriously. <gasps> Erica, wait! We need to get the hazelnuts to come back. What? Never. Changing your mind makes you look weak. We need them. Trust me. It's never too late to put the pieces back together.
right, Eriko, they're all back! Yeah, now we can get back to practice. No, Eriko! You might be the greatest football player in the world, but Maple is a better coach than you! Are you kidding? Maybe one day you'll be a great coach, but right now we need to find Maple. Hey, hey, good morning, world. Watch up, hot chat. Nice dive. Hey, Hansel. Hi, back at you. Hiya, Sylvia. How you doing? Hey. What's the best way to make a small fortune in the stock market? Start off with a big fortune. <laughs> <laughs> good one, Patrick. Good one. Bye, bye. Sell, sell. Bye, for goodness sake. Maple, hmm? you hear? Wow, Maple. Daniel? We're sorry about everything. Is everything okay, Michael? Children aren't allowed on the sales floor. Everything's fine, Jane. I've got it under control. We're sorry about everything, Maple. That's not my name anymore, Daniel. I've left that life behind me. And here we go! We're really sorry! Really, really sorry. <laughs> Is everything okay, Michael? We failed. Maple isn't coming back. No more hazelnuts. No more, no <laughs> more hazelnuts. Bye. Never abandon you again. <laughs> the program today is Meditation and Tribal Percussion. Yeah! <laughs> well, my work here is done. I'm leaving. Wait, 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 wait. Don't I get a song? <sighs> Goodbye, Mr. Coach. We sure had fun, but now, now it's, it's done. done. Now it's done! Yeah. Make me proud, kids. And don't forget, never give away my autograph for free. Yeah! Okay, Hazelnuts, gather round. I've got some exciting news. Oh, am I the new team captain? Captain! Daddy! <sighs> um, not quite, Stephen. The mayor's office is looking for a young athlete for their new billboard campaign. Who would like to help promote an active lifestyle? Hmm? No way, Daniel. I'm not gonna play ball in some public ad campaign. <laughs> Did someone say... Hmm? Handsome athlete. Oh, and what's that? The new official pro league football? Crystal. Crystal? Pfft, how pretentious. Oh. Twelve hand-sewn panels for extra precise trajectories. Micro-textured exterior for better ball control. Fully inflated on delivery. Oh. No one overshadows Platana. <laughs> <gasps> What's the matter, Sisu? You think you're better than me with your beach ball? <gasps> now, come on, Hazelnuts. 
Let's all be good sports. Yeah, with a duel and lasers and explosions! And snakes! Ooh! Stop. Violence is never the answer. But we can easily sort this out in a fair and fun way. On your mark, stars of the future! Boo! You said there'd be lasers! The first one to cross the finish line gets their face on the billboard! Hang on! Hmm? Wait for me! Uh, Steven? Yeah, that's me! Ah! You're covered in bugs! Oh, this? It's nothing special, just my old lucky football! They're more scared of you than you are of them. Hmm. Erico, we're gonna play together! Focus, Daniel! You have to win the head game first. Tackle your opponent's mind. Nice hairdo. Tell me, do they make those for football players? <laughs> you know, I always thought you were a decent player. A flute player! <laughs> Number 10. Hmm? More like zero! <laughs> ah, I made a lot of players cry. Okay, let's go. I'll psych out Crystal, you deal with Larry. Ah, Crystal! Neon color, huh? Classy. For a bowling ball! Ah, Larry. Nice sweatshirt. A real champion sweatshirt. I guess it's fair since you're our best striker. Hey, don't you ignore me! Do you know who I am? And our best defender, and our best goalie. Don't know what to say, huh? Ha! That's more like it. You smell good, too. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Set! over already? Larry and Daniel, I guess there's no choice. Get ready for the intermediate level course. Ah! No one ties Platana. No one! Plan B. We bribe Larry and Crystal to let us win. Uh, isn't that cheating? Cheating, cheating. Let's not get carried away. There it go. Daniel. <laughs> Not to take away! <laughs> Fine. You win, Erico. Um, mm, mm, mm. Handsome. <laughs> what are you doing here, Sisu? I've got a deal for you, Larry. Would you let me win if I gave you a cookie? No. All right, listen up. I need you to abandon the next race. Do we understand each other? What? Not enough for you? You know what tastes good with a cookie? A big glass of cold milk. Deal? Deal. One born every second. I'll just leave this here and see you out on the field. <laughs> hmm? On your mark, future stars. Boo! You said there'd be explosions. <laughs> yes, yeah, Steven, you can have another try. Ready, set. <laughs> That's not cool. We had a deal. Well, I guess there's only one other way. What a race! <laughs> ah, too many bugs! Another tie? You're going to drive me nuts! I didn't want it to come to this, but I guess it's time for the 
the advanced level course. Yeah! <laughs> we have no choice, Daniel. Plan C. You attack me, and we blame Larry. You ready? What? Do it! Don't overthink it. I can't do it, Erico! I just can't! Come on, don't be shy. <laughs> no! I can't hurt my best friend! Daniel! Come back! Oh, man. That does it. Plan D. We eliminate Crystal. Yeah, too old. Too bald. Too classic. No, oh, here we go. This guy's a real pro. Uh... Hey, what about the check? <laughs> and the tip? <laughs> Lying low before the final, huh? Sorry, kiddo, but you've already lost. No hard feelings. You're a tough one, aren't you? You remind me of when I was starting out. I had a fluorescent period, too. We'll show them, old ball. That's what real friends do. They fight together to the end. You just start in your career and bam. You come up against me. I mean, I've never lost a game, ever. So a public ad campaign, <laughs> what do I care? Hey, that's right. I don't care. I finally understand, Erico. I'm sorry. If you really want to win, I'm here for you. No. Wait, Daniel. I've changed my mind. I don't care about winning. Crystal needs this victory more than we do. See you. That's great. Now we can do the last race just for fun. Yeah, Daniel. I may have gone a tiny bit too far. <laughs> There'd be snakes. Wait! Wait! Mm -hmm. <laughs> Drop out of the race, Crystal! It's a matter of life or death! Drop out of the race, Larry! It's a matter of life or death! Let go of me, Sisu! Ready? Hmm. Hmm. Set. Get back to it. Uh, are you really okay, Erico? No, oh, nasty beast. <laughs> Let's get back to it. Time, Daniel, the last time. No kids, no way around it. No practice today. Oh. That stupid rain. <laughs> Why? Do something. We can't be stopped. We can't be stopped by a tiny, a tiny bit of rain, right? 
<clears throat> Every year is the same thing. Every year the roof leaks, and as a result, Maple calls off practice. Yeah, just like every year. That's right. But this time, we're going to raise money to fix the roof. Huh? Uh, we already tried that last year with calendars, but we only sold five. Aww. Well, maybe. But this year, we might find another idea. We're going to record an album. Yay! Hmm. That's not a bad idea. We're going to record the Hazelnut album. Not to brag, but I know a thing or two about music. All right, auditions in five minutes. Yay! Next. I can't, I can't, I can't. What's wrong, Daniel? Stage fright? I can't sing in front of people. My voice, it's really bad. No, it can't be that bad. Go on, sing something. <clears throat> <gasps> Stop! Okay, it is that bad. I told you so. I'm gonna ruin the album. <laughs> Don't worry, little buddy. I know what to do. I'll sing. You can lip sync. Oh, yeah! How could I have forgotten that you're also a great singer? I even have your album. Yep, they're collector's albums, you know. I, uh, only sold five. <laughs> I was too far ahead of my time, but that's about to change. A real artist can feel these things. Whenever you're ready, Daniel. Just a sec. <laughs> that was beautiful, Daniel. Beautiful. It's the miracle I've been waiting for, for so long. I wasn't always a football coach. There was a time when I sang to stop pollution, to stop us going to war. I was a rising star in world music. That was a long time ago. But your voice, Daniel, your voice is a gift from above. With it, we won't be just saving the gym. We'll be saving the world. I go, my K.O. Get ready, hazelnuts. Things are about to go platinum. <laughs> and that's a wrap. Great work, hazelnuts. But we didn't even sing. Mm. Our turn now, Daniel. Time is money and we don't have any. <laughs> Great job, Daniel. It's really moving, but you're lagging just a bit. Oh, uh, sorry. Lagging? It's his music that's ahead. No biggie. Let's take it from the top. And go, Daniel! <laughs> Stop! You're really not far off, but I think you can do better. Hey! Who does he think he is, Mozart? No one tells Patara to sing! No one. Erica, wait! Uh, take five? Calm down, Erico. Maple is demanding, but it's for the sake of the album. I'm a high-performance sports car, okay? When you lift the hood, you wear gloves. You know, I get it if you're afraid to fail. Fail? In your dreams. Come on, let's go back in there. Stop! You're singing in B-flat there, Daniel. I need you to give it 200%. What? Mm -hmm. I will show you 200%. That's the one.
Now I know it, Daniel. Your voice is the real thing. Let me tell you a story. After my first album, which went triple platinum, I went off in search of a new sound. I was looking for the note of pure love. Mother Nature's heartfelt call. It was in that forgotten monastery that I found it. The Forbidden Octave. Forbidden Octave. score from my album. I thought I was good enough to sing it, but I was wrong. I failed, Daniel. But you can do it. I truly believe you can reach the forbidden octave and change the world! <laughs> Finally, a challenge worthy of me! <laughs> Destiny is to be the greatest footballer and the greatest singer. That's not what I said at all. Thanks, Daniel. I believe in me, too. Don't do it, Eriko. Look, the notes on this scroll form the shape of a skull. Look, it's smiling at me. Okay, Daniel. You ready? Ready. Maple? I don't know if I can reach the Forbidden Octave. No pressure, Daniel. It's just the future of humanity, after all. <laughs> okay, here we go. Mr. Monks, please make sure that Eriko doesn't hurt himself singing. Hmm? Now! Sorry, Eriko, but I had to stop you! What?! My ears are still ringing! I can't hear! Oh, let me guess, you're apologizing for ruining my album with your terrible voice! <laughs> <laughs> we heard your call, my child. <laughs> oh, dang it. We're too late. You! Butchin! You stole our sacred song for your own glory! It's true! Wrapped up in my pride, I forgot the true meaning of music. I put you through unreasonable risk, Daniel. <laughs> what have I become? I should have listened to you, Daniel. I'm sorry, Daniel! <laughs> Please, take this. It belongs to you, Mr. Monks. You are wise beyond your years, duck-voiced child. Forbidden Octave! No kids, no way around it. I have to apologize. It's all my fault that the album flopped. Aww. Wait! It's true that our CD is lame, but it must be good for something. Hmm. <laughs> Great idea, Daniel! It doesn't look like you'll be making a singing comeback, Eriko. Don't worry, Daniel. I learned something much more important today. <laughs> that my first album was already perfect! <laughs> Thank you.
That's my yacht. Wow. Do you still have it? Nah, sank it. Made me seasick. That's me dabbing on my tank. Wow. Do you still have it? Nah, sold it online. Those are my cool sneakers. That's my wolf. Those are my really cool sneakers. You've got a wolf? Canyon. He was like a brother to me. A brother who didn't wear pants. Wow! <laughs> it is an honor to be your friend, Daniel. Do you still have it? Whoa! Ah! Wow! Ah! It's him! I can feel it! <laughs> um... Are you sure he'll remember you? Nobody forgets Erico Platana. What's up, Canyon? Where's Daddy's big old wolfy wolf? You all right, Erico? It's fine. It's all good. This is just how we greet each other in the pack. Are you sure you're friends? Of course I'm sure. Relax. I can't wait to take him back to your place. <laughs> You sure he's house trained? He's just getting his bearings. It's completely normal. What? Daniel, we said no animals in the house. You've got ten. I'll pretend I didn't see anything to get rid of it. One, I'll pretend I didn't see anything. Two, I'll pretend I didn't see anything. Is that a dog I hear? You know that's against the rules. We'll talk about it later. Bye! Maybe he can stay a little longer. Woohoo! Did you hear that, Canyon? My best bud! I thought I was your best friend! Canyon, but uh, don't you think he's kind of uh, aggressive? You don't get it because you're not part of the pack, Daniel. Well, then, how come I'm always the one cleaning up his fur, cooking his food, and changing his litter box? Yeah, sorry, Daniel. Alpha males don't do that kind of work. <laughs> hey! Cool it, Mr. Canyon! I'm the one paying for your food with my own pocket money, you know! What up? <laughs> Headlowered ears flattened. With this posture, the wolf shows his submission to the new alpha male. <laughs> Wait till you hear this. Canyon buried me in the garden again. <laughs> Can you believe it? You big bad wolf. Oh no, the bus! We're gonna be late for practice! Canyon. Whoa. I like his smell. He smells like cinnamon. And torment. <laughs> Whatever. He's just a dog. <laughs> Beware, Daniel. A wolf might lick your head, but he never forgets. Call of the Wild. Oh, 
Okay, kids, back to practice. Yay! Bye, Daniel. Bye, Bye Karen. See you tomorrow, guys. Hey, nobody forgets Erico Platana. I had to come by foot. By foot! Yeah! <laughs> oh, come on! Night Canyon. Is he wearing a sweater with your face on it? <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. He's wild and free. Whatever. I understand Canyon much better than you do. They even call me the Wolf Child. Wolf Child. Me and Canyon, we're in the same pack. No bond is stronger than that. We'll see who he likes best. Here, Canyon. Come here, come here. Canyon. Canyon. You like me better than Daniel. Canyon! You like me better than that mean old soccer ball. You like <laughs> me better. Who's gonna be the cutest wolf in the world? Canyon! 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 <laughs> it's so obvious he likes me better. No way! So wrong! I'm taking Canyon for the weekend. We're going to the zoo for some male bonding. What? But it's my turn! We're invited to the neighbor's dog's birthday party. I think there's a little something going on between those two. Canyon would rather go to the zoo. You gave him... <laughs> you gave him cotton candy? How many times... <laughs> How many times do I have to tell you he's allergic? Baloney loves the stuff. <laughs> He really doesn't seem well. Should we call someone? Shame on you. What did you do to this poor hound? His chakras are blocked, his eyes are lifeless, and his hair is falling out. Like me. I can donate some of my facial hair. Once I actually grow some. Aww. This wolf needs a change. I'll take him to the park. And I'll take him to Ibiza. Jet skiing, all inclusive. Look, Daniel. That's no life for a wolf. He's meant to be with his own kind. Oh. In the wild. Maple's right! Sorry, Canyon! <laughs> Come on, he's totally fine. And if you don't want him anymore, I'll keep him. Look! You can see he's unhappy. Oh, even as a cop, he was jealous of my convertible. That's us in the emergency room. He refused to let go of my leg. You were already inseparable. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I think you're right, Daniel. The time has come for my best friend to go back to his first love. 
Mother Nature. Go on, Canyon. Go back to the great open spaces of the wild. I'll always be there for you. Even if I'm only your second best friend. If Canyon goes, you might get back to the top of the list. Finally! You almost missed my top 100 corner kicks. Sorry, Erico. I, I wanted a brioche from the bakery, but I got lost on the way back. So, where's your brioche? Daniel? <laughs> Somebody took it! What? <laughs> ah, stealing from a child! Who did this to you, Daniel? Who? <laughs> Come on! We're going back there! What? Uh, I don't know if that's a good idea, Erico. I don't like to lecture, Daniel, but I'm gonna teach you a golden rule today. Never let anyone kick you around. Listen up, Daniel. In a fight, look him right in the eye. Never apologize. Yes, Erico. You're avoiding eye contact, aren't you? Sorry, Erico. You just apologized. I mean, sorry. No, 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 sorry. Oh. Don't worry, Daniel. I'll teach you how to make people respect you. You ever been in a fight? Me? What's your problem? What's your problem? You got a 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 problem? <laughs> <laughs> So, who was it? Who stole your snack? The chubby kid over there? <laughs> okay, was it the tall guy over there? <laughs> really? Hmm. It's not those two weirdos back there, is it? The tattooed bald guy? The female bodybuilder? The crazy guy talking to himself? Me. Nobody can hear us, my friend. That's your bully? <laughs> Seriously, Daniel, at your age, mugged by a fat pigeon? Be careful, Erico. It's just a bird, Daniel. What's it gonna do? Easy, my friend. Erico, watch out! Nah, it's fine, Daniel. It's just protecting its nest. Swans are social animals. Reaching out shows it that I'm a friend. Easy, does it? Easy, buddy. Easy. You okay, Erico? Uh, uh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm fine. It just surprised me. Now we get down to business. Business? Business. Tell a responsible grown-up. That's what I mean by business. Warden! That swan stole this kid's snack! It's outrageous! That swan there. Slow down, little piggy. No. Aww. Hmm. Oh, come on! This is all some sick trick! I know your little games! That swan is vicious and violent. It's a real sicko. You're my best friend. That bird's as gentle as they come. Can't you get your snack back yourself? Oh, unless you're scared of it, of course. In that case, no problem. I totally get it. Scared? Me? Scared? Scared? Puh. Lots of people are scared of birds, you know. Lots of people. Just say the word and I'll take care of it. He'll take care of it. What do you think this is? Scared. Do you know who I am? Scared. Ha, <laughs> yeah, right. 
Better not complain if some feathers fly! You're really gonna do it, Eriko? You're going to beat up the swan? The golden rule, Daniel. Never let anyone kick you around. <laughs> hmm. Uh, listen, I I'd rather avoid any violence in front of the kid. How much do you want for the brioche? Five? Maybe ten? <laughs> oh, would you prefer a bank transfer? <laughs> You okay, Eriko? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. I'm, I'm fine. You sure? I'm telling you, I'm fine. Come on, let's go. I'm, I'm fine. But what about your phone? I let him borrow it, okay? And what were you doing in the park in the first place, huh? Showing off your brioche. Oh, uh, I always walk through the park. Well, from now on, go around it. Or take the bus, I don't know. But that takes longer. Just don't go through the park anymore, okay? End of discussion. Erico, aren't you gonna turn on the TV? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. <laughs> Blown by our famous <laughs> craftsman, these collectible glass swans will embellish your home with a touch of grace. You okay, Erico? <laughs> it's just a commercial. Yeah. Yeah, 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 I'm fine. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm completely fine. Uh, can I sleep in your bed tonight? Nighty night, kiddo. Nighty night, Mom. Nighty night, Erico. Mwah. Okay, I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine. Fine, fine, fine. Ready, Ashlyn? On this baby, I can go zero to 60 in only four seconds. <laughs> You're so cool, Erico. I can't wait for you to meet my parents. <laughs> swans, swans, swans everywhere. Oh, the the necks are so long. <laughs> Get away from me, swan. <laughs> Don't have to be scared anymore, Erico. The nightmare will soon be over. Ah! Daniel, you up already? I'm going back to the park, Erico. We can't live in fear like this. What? You can't do that. That thing will shred you to pieces. Too bad. I'd rather fight than be afraid. And I don't like seeing you this way. You... You do that for me? You've never actually been in a fight, have you? Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, Erico. I got this. Wait. I won't let you go there. Not without me. The golden rule, Daniel. No, no one, one kicks us around! around. I don't see it. Too bad. Let's go home. There it is. Hey! We've come to take back our stuff. So you better get out of here if you don't want any trouble. Has it gotten bigger since yesterday? With the two of us, we outnumber him. Hmm. 
It was nice knowing you, Daniel. Charge! Charge! <laughs> So, I popped at least three stitches and we're banned from the park for life. Worth it! So worth it! And I'm not scared of swans anymore. Same. Nobody will ever steal my snack again. How come? It tastes like mud and pond water. Yeah, eat up, Daniel. That's the sweet taste of victory and justice. <sighs> oh. Kids these days, always up to no good. <sighs> but never forget, if someone's bothering you, tell a responsible adult about it. And never hurt animals. It's dangerous for you and for them. <gasps> no littering! Paper goes in the trash or the recycling. And hey, Terry, if you're gonna run...